So if the supraspinatus gets impinged, as you can see, it sits right on top of the shoulder blade and it runs underneath our acromion on our scapula and it attaches onto the humeral head. So when we try to do that overhead movement, so if we're gonna go into abduction or flexion, you can see how the tendon can get pinched, especially if we have the humeral head sitting more forward or sitting a little bit higher. There's a lot more narrow in here and this is how we can end up getting that impingement. And over time, this tendon through here, the constant wear and tear of rubbing between the two bones, uh, this can become problematic and become a rotator cuff tear.